The mayor to council members, Nashville officials are looking for answers from Core Civic following an outbreak of what's believed to be scabies at their detention facility. As News Channel 5's Kyle Horan tells us, a special meeting was called to address the issue. Kyle, Core Civic may not even be there. Formerly known as Corrections Corporation of America, CoreCivic is a private contractor in charge of some detention facilities in Tennessee. Citing pending litigation from city employees who say they contracted the scabies parasite, CoreCivic told a Metro Council member they would not attend a meeting that was called for them so they could answer questions. The same council member is now saying CoreCivic has been unresponsive with city staff this whole time. And that's what we've been told to. Kathleen Murphy just wants to talk. They could come and, and offer some information instead of no information. To someone over at Core Civic. It's a concern of mine that we have employees who are not being protected or communicated with. Which is why she, in part, called a meeting to talk about it today. A meeting which Core Civic officials turned down. They have notified me that they do not feel they can come. I think that is unacceptable that they cannot come and answer basic questions. I understand that there may be some questions that we ask that they feel legally they cannot answer because of pending lawsuits. There is a pending lawsuit on behalf of Metro staff who say they and their families were infected by the parasite scabies. The outbreak happened among inmates in May, but spread from the detention center over to Metro Court. Murphy wants to know how that happened. How would you rate Core Civic's communication so far? Very poor. Why? Because it's been very lacking. Um, say next to nothing. She wants to know what procedures are in place to keep something like this from happening. How the courts can be notified if an inmate is infected. And if they don't feel like they are beholden to, to or responsible to come and, and speak with us who pay for their contract, who pay for their services, then, then that raises a lot of red flags for me, and I don't think it's acceptable by any means. And since she feels Core Civic is not being open, Murphy is questioning whether or not the city should continue to contract with the company. I don't think that this is going to be the end of it, um, unfortunately. And the health department is reporting that there have been no new cases of scabies like rashes in Core Civic Detention Center. Kyle Horan, News Channel 5.